So to collaborate in Keynote or pages or numbers, um, I'm going to first open up my Keynote app and I'm going to create a new presentation. Um, now, a couple important things. I need to make sure that I create that presentation in my iCloud Drive. So I can actually click on iCloud Drive over here on the left and then tell it to create that presentation right from inside that drive. When I do it, I want to tell it to choose a theme and I'm going to use my mobile app template. Now, once it opens, in the upper right-hand corner, I have a collaboration button. And when I tap on that, it's going to give me a lot of different options on different ways to collaborate. The one I want to use is one called Copy Link. So I'm going to go ahead and tell it to Copy Link. And now I'm going to enter in the Apple ID of the person I want to share this document with. Um, I could go ahead and type in Smith. And it'll show me all of the people in the district who have an Apple ID that matches that. So I would simply find Mrs. Smith's name and tap on it. And then I tell it to copy link. Now, once I tell it to copy link, it's going to tell me most likely that it's starting the collaboration. Once the starting collaboration message disappears, I should now see a check mark up here at the top in my uh, collaboration window. And it tells me, yes, this person is now collaborating. Now, from the other side, the person you're collaborating with, in this case, Mrs. Smith, if she opens up her version of Keynote, she will see an option up here on the left that says Shared Documents. This is where you will see anything that has been shared to you. So I had a, a person share this to me today, and if I go ahead and tap on the presentation to open it, I am now part of this presentation, all right? Again, I get the check mark in there and I can see who is collaborating with this document. All I have to do is hit edit and now both of us will be able to make these changes. Now, if you try collaborating with the other person and the window never pops up. So if I hit the collaboration button and you never get the window uh, to copy that link where you to enter in the other person's name, then there's a chance you may not be signed into your Apple ID. The best thing to do is to have them other group members share that document with you instead. So instead of you creating it and sharing it to them, have them create it and share it to you. Uh, and then that should prompt the window asking for you to sign into your Apple ID with your birth date. And once you've done that, you should be good to go for collaboration.